you ever seen an oyster this big? This is a fossil oyster. It's in the genus Exogyra. They make a nice little container. I use them for some things. I met some people that said that they found a megalodon tooth down the way and some vertebrae of mosasaur, which is a giant aquatic dinosaur. It's the one that's in a Jurassic World, the one that jumps out of the water and eats them at the end. And this area in general has a lot of different sea fossils because it was actually underwater around 200 to 100 million years ago. All of central Texas went under a shallow sea and it was periodically inundated and withdrew. And this formation in particular, the QAL formation, was only deposited in the last 12,000 years and it has a lot of sand and silt, gravel, but more than anything almost is the quantity of flint. So there's some really high quality flint in the area and I'm always searching for some good stuff. They have some reddish colored stuff, some root beer flint, huge variety and I'm always finding something new. There's Chalcedony also. And I've also found artifacts in this area, particularly preforms or hand axes, no good arrowheads yet with the natives in the area we're certainly taking advantage of the flint in this creek as i am today i've even finished some of their work for them here's a nice piece of flint I'm taking that one home well i'll break it open and test it sure wish there were still oysters this big and be some good eating